Looks like we have some more rain coming this way. Again. Look how steep these rocks are. I see some place of interest. Man. These rocks are very steep. You know I'm up for the challenge. I'm not going to give up. But look at this place. Man, are you kidding? No geocaching box? Okay, this is for a good geocaching box right here. Almost impossible place for people to find. You have to be a, plum, a prime explorer. Oh, Got to be a, a prime explorer to find one out here. But I know, I know what you guys are saying. This is not geocaching is for kids also. So why would you hide it in some place that's dangerous? I know you're right. I'm just thinking about people who are willing to go to the limit. Willing to go to the max of their abilities to find something cool. Yeah, it's steep. It's very steep. It's probably about maybe 39, 40 degrees maybe. But I'm trying to find this masterpiece. It's a dead oak tree. I'm not oak tree, but it's a dead cedar on the west side of the mountain up here. But I think I've gone too low. But it looks like it was sculpted by the winds in the waters of eternity. I wanted to show it to you guys. But I don't know if it's over here or it's over there. I don't know. It's been a while since I found it. It was perfect. Like that little thing there. Yeah, you don't care. That's okay. I'm still going to make my movies. <laughs> if you don't care, I'm still going to make my movies. I'm trying to get you guys to care. Oh, man. This is so hard on the knees. It really is. Oh, man. It takes forever to get down here, though. It really does. Because you got to already slip once. I did. Look at my right hand. It's scabbed. It's not scabbed up, but it's skid up. Because I slipped on one of these rocks. I was trying to move too fast and I fell on my butt and rolled down about 10 feet. But I also have to look out for snakes. They love these rocks and they love the grasses. And the little rattlesnakes. The pygmy rattlesnakes, you can't even see them. You can see them in the grass, but they look just like this crap here. I mean the moss, the lichen moss. They look like just cozy, whatever. Yeah, we've gone too low. Yeah, we're gone. We've gone too low. But I want to come up here and see if there's a geocaching box up here in this rock. You know we're going to have to do a ch tick check when we get out of here. Man, it's so hard to get through these places. See, this is fun. It is. This is really fun. It's not going to be fun if it starts storming. Got to break out that plastic bag like I do every single day. I see an ancient cedar up there. I think that's a way to ruin the atmosphere with your house alarm. Yeah, I don't see a geocaching box. I don't see any carvings either. Man. Yeah, last time I came out here was in the fall. So the grass wasn't that high. But I think we've gone too low. It's a clearing in the granite rock exposed areas of perfection where you get a lot of sun yeah it's weird i came down this exact location so i should be able to find it i think it's behind us though way up on the hillside
I missed it. And it takes forever just to get around this place. Because everything is an obstacle. But I get around every obstacle. I do. Because it's a challenge. If there was a bed of rattlesnakes, you better believe I'm going to be sitting there trying to plan out my route to go over it. Look at that masterpiece. That's not the one I'm talking about. I remember that one quite well. Oh, man. Yeah, you better believe I'm out of breath. <sighs> this is a steep hill. And I just felt a raindrop. Yeah, I'm falling backwards. But everything I've ever done has been planned out. Everything I do, there's got to be a plan in place. Man, you guys think this is ugly. I know you think that's ugly. I don't. Looks like it needs to be painted bright blue. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, yeah. Everything I've ever done has been a plan. You got to plan accordingly ahead of time. You do. You have got to plan accordingly. You don't take another step until something's planned out. Because everything in life, in a way, is an obstacle. It is. Is that the clearing up there? I don't know. But there's a dead cedar that's just molded by time in the waters, and it is flawless. I wanted it, you know, fantasize about how I'm going to take it out of here. It probably weighs about five, you know, the masterpiece in front of you. Yeah, all right. Yeah, that's all you do down here, zigzag back and forth. Look at that incline. You're going to drop straight down if you don't have both hands. When you step on this grass, it's going to slip under your feet. Yeah, it is. Trust me, I know. Don't step on the cactus. See, we headed back up. We're headed up to go down. This is great though, look at this, it's perfect. This reminds me of the good old days, it does. We're walking in the fields of time. Come on, give us something good. Let me see the strike. You guys probably aren't gonna see it. You don't know this, do you? Lightning strikes don't show up on iPhones unless it's dark, unless it's night. They don't. They don't show up on the video unless it's dark outside, if it's dark. Did you see that? I don't know. Every time I try to capture lightning storms on the iPhone in real time, I know I'll capture some good ones, but every time I look at the video, there's nothing there. It's like a ghost at night. There is no ghost though. It's like that flash. Hope you guys like these videos. See that? I think it's coming our way. Look at that sheet of rain and the sun's behind it. That's crazy. They're coming for us. It's moving fast over here, guys. It's moving real fast. You see it? I bet you did I bet you didn't. I bet you didn't. You guys are saying I'm crazy. It's only about probably three miles away from us. And I'm sitting out here in this clear zone on the mountain. 
Yeah, it's moving over here. It is. Crap. I'm waiting. I'm waiting for the strike. I'm waiting for the flash. Because I'm trying to study. I'm trying to see if it's going to show up on camera. It never has before. It's weird. The iPhone doesn't capture the strike of lightning. Unless it's dark. Oh yeah, she's moving real fast. We look like we're in a, a safe zone over there. Yeah, I don't understand. The lightning strikes don't show up on the camera. I mean, they'll show up on the screen, but they don't show up in the actual video footage. Here she comes. Here it comes. Now the... It's that white sky behind it. That's what's dropping all the rain. It's the white sky. You're gonna learn about that white sky. She's getting closer. I know this should be a time lapse, shouldn't it? But there's no place to put the phone out here. It'll take me probably 30 minutes just to level it on these rocks. All right. They're getting dumped on out there. Look at that. I love doing this kind of stuff. She's getting closer. There was a flash over here. Dang, we gotta go guys. We're gonna get struck if we don't watch out. I gotta go sideways just to get down because it's so steep out here. Is it gonna stop? I don't know. I'll get back to you in a minute. 